आउज़बिल्लिमिनशानजीम बसमीम रबी ज़िद नीम रबी शहली सदरी असली अमरी वाहमदा तम्बी लिसानी यफ़ा कौली लेट स्टार्ट द यूनिट नंबर वन नंबर्स टू नाइन थाउजेंड नाइन हंड्रेड एंड नाइन्टी नाइन यूनिट नंबर वन नंबर्स टू नाइन थाउजेंड नाइन हंड्रेड एंड नाइन्टी नाइन फर्स्टली वी कंसेप्ट दाउजेंड हंड्रेड टेंस एंड यूनिट वी लर्न द कंसेप्ट ऑफ थाउजेंड Hundred, ten, and unit. <coughs> What? A <coughs> thousand, hundred, tens, and unit. Uh, if any di- uh, number have a four digit, it means this is the thousand digit. Start with thousand. Four, one, five, seven. Unit ten hundred thousand. Unit seven hundred fifty seven. Sorry, th- tens five tens fifty seven. Hundred one hundred and fifty seven. Four thousand. <coughs> If we write the thousand, hundred, tens, and unit. If the first number is unit, then it's mean this is the seven. If the five and seven, it's mean fifty seven. If the first number is one, five and seven, one place on hundred, it's mean one hundred and fifty seven. One hundred. And fifty-seven. If we write the seven, five, one, and four. Four is placed on thousand. One is placed on hundred. Five is placed on ten. Seven is placed on unit. Four is placed on uh, thousand. It means four is four thousand. Four thousand one hundred one hundred and fifty-seven. Four thousand one seven is placed on unit, so we write the seven. Seven is placed on unit and five is placed on ten. It means this have a two number. Two number have a uh, uh, ten, so fifty seven. Uh, start uh, with one hundred, one hundred and fifty seven. Start with thousand, four thousand one hundred and fifty seven. in page number page number 4 you have a some boxes cube boxes cube boxes some have a sheets and some have a strips This cube boxes is the equal to thousand. Cube box is equal to thousand. This is the sheet is equal to hundred, and this is the sheet uh, strip is equal to ten. How many <coughs> thousand? One. One box cube. It's mean one. How many sheets? One, two, three. It's mean three hundred. 
and how many strips 1, 10, 20, 30, 40. This strips have a uh, 10 uh, boxes. So, this strips is equal to 10, 10, 20, 30 and 40. <coughs> And this is the single boxes. It is equal to 1. This is 4. Then answer is 4. It means 1344. 1344. So write this that with <coughs> now <coughs> solve the question number 1. Solve the question number 1. Question number 1 is write the number show as in each mat. Question number 1 A part. How many cubes? 3. How many cubes? 3000. And how many sheets? 2. And how many strips? 7, 4, 5, 6, 7. And how many single uh, boxes? 4. It means 3000 because cube is the represent the 1000, sheet represent the 100. How many sheets? 2, 200. How many strips? Strips, strips represent the 10, 1, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70. This is 70 and one box is equal to 1. So, 1, 2, 3, 4. It means the number is 3274. Just write the answer is 1, 2, 3, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 7, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 70, 1, 2, 3, 4, 4, 3,274 unit, 10, 100, 1,000, 3,274, this is the concept of 1,000, 100, tens and unit, 1,000, 100, tens and unit. <coughs> Now the start the question number 2 write the number show by in, in each arrow card. This is also the concept belongs to 1000, 100, tens and unit. Page number 4. Question number 1. Homework. Now <coughs> page number 5. Page number five, uh, five, write the number show by each arrow card. Question number two, write the number shown by each arrow card. It is very simple questions. Just uh, you have uh, uh, this question belongs to the concept thousand, hundred, tens, and unit. First part is eight thousand, seven hundred, twenty, and three. It's mean <coughs> just add these number eight thousand plus seven hundred plus twenty plus three. 8000 plus 700 plus 20 plus 3. <clears throat> it's mean now we write the just simple word 8000 write the first digit just write the first digit 8723. <clears throat> now next B part. 6970 
this is number are missing no any number in this question it's mean 6970 add these number if any number are missing you have also uh, you uh, also write the zero 6000 900 plus 70 plus 0 it's mean we write the number 6970 this is very easy so question number 2 C to H part is your homework. Okay, now start the question number three. Question number three. Firstly, we write the uh, numbers. Uh, we write the numbers uh, uh, in. Uh, we write the numbers and now we draw uh, we write the we draw the line join the line uh, uh, words with numbers <clears throat> in previous class in one uh, you also uh, learned the uh, number uh, with uh, numbers and uh, number and word numbers word uh, so uh, just we uh, join the number with words draw a line to joining matching number and words Question number three: Join the matching numbers and words. <clears throat> First is three thousand. Three hundred and thirty-three. Now, next number is two thousand two hundred and two. Next number is three thousand Next number is two thousand and twelve. Next number is three thousand. And the next number is two thousand. And twenty. This uh, word also write the two thousand two hundred and two, three hundred, two thousand and twelve, two thousand and twenty, three thousand and thirty, three hundred and thirty three, three thousand. First question is three thousand three hundred and thirty three. Three thousand three hundred and thirty three. Next question is two thousand two hundred and two. Two thousand two hundred and two. Next number is three thousand. This is very simple. Three thousand. Next is two thousand and twelve. Two thousand and twelve. Three thousand three hundred. This is not the three thousand. This is the hundred. Three hundred. So match with three hundred. Next last digit is two thousand and twenty. Two thousand and twenty. It's very simple. Now next page number five. Page number five. Uh, just. 
we learned the concept reading and writing number reading and writing number reading and writing number <coughs> Uh, we learned the concept of uh, uh, reading the numbers. <coughs> this is, this, uh, for example, two. This is two. For example, this is thirty-two. For example, this is three hundred. For example, this is four thousand. Just we learned the concept with four digit, not five digit, not three digit. Just we learn in this uh, chapter. Just we learn the concept of four digit. <coughs> this is unit. This is tens, this is hundred, and this is thousand. Okay. Now, uh, uh, first question is question number one. Read this and write each number as write each as a number. First question is three thousand nine hundred and twenty-five. Question number one. Three thousand nine hundred and twenty five. Three thousand. It's mean this is the four. Uh, the, uh, this question number. Uh, this uh, question have a four number. This question have four number three thousand nine hundred and last digit is twenty five unit ten hundred thousand first digit is unit ten hundred and thousand <coughs> next part is nine thousand. Four hundred and seventy nine. This is very easy concept. Nine thousand, nine thousand four hundred and seventy nine. Nine thousand, nine thousand four hundred. And seventy nine. Okay. Now uh, question number page number six. Question number four. So question number one. C two F part is your homework. Now. <clears throat> in uh, in this question we learn the uh, we learn the. A uh, word. Uh, write the word. Uh, write the number. Uh, write the number. Now, next concept. Write each of these number as word. Now, we write the word of these number. Question number two. First part is seven thousand eight hundred and fifty-four. <coughs> now, how uh, learn the that number? You you not ten hundred thousand. How read that? How read uh, the number? Unit ten hundred and thousand. It's mean thousand with uh, seven start with thousand. Seven thousand eight hundred and fifty four. Thousand hundred ten unit. Seven thousand eight hundred and fifty four. <coughs> it's mean seven thousand eight hundred and 
54 tens uh, we uh, read the uh, number uh, joining uh, the tens and unit join the tens and unit 7854 next number is One, five, three, and three. One thousand five hundred and thirty-three. Remember that last two digit read with the join. One thousand five hundred and thirty-three. One thousand five hundred and thirty-three. Seven thousand eight hundred and fifty four. <clears throat> so, uh, all the part uh, from B to uh, B to. F same like as part A. Question number two, B to F is your homework. <clears throat> Now look at the uh, each number. Circle the digit that match the value. Now question number three, page number seven. Question number three. Look at each number. Circle the digit that matches the value. <coughs> You have a number nine thousand nine hundred and twenty-nine. Nine thousand nine hundred and twenty-nine unit ten hundred thousand. Nine thousand. Look at each number. Look at each number. Circle the digit that match the value. Nine <clears> thousand. <throat> It's mean where is the place a thousand value? Unit ten hundred thousand. It's mean circle the well place value of thousand. B part is three thousand two hundred and twenty. If you write the uh, uh, upper the number, write the unit ten hundred and thousand. This is very easy for you. If you write the uh, unit ten thousand and hundred two. Hundred. Two hundred is unit ten hundred thousand. Where is the place value of hundred? This. So circle the two hundred. C part. Seven thousand eight hundred and eighty. Unit ten hundred thousand. So eighty. This is eighty. Eighty means the tens number. Tens number. It's mean tens. Eighty, twenty, thirty, forty-three, forty-four, forty-five. This is the tens number. Tens number means these numbers have a two values. D part. <coughs> D part is. Five thousand five hundred and fifty-seven and five hundred. Where is the place value of hundred? Unit ten hundred thousand. Place value of hundred five. E part two thousand and twenty. Answer is two thousand and twenty. 
2000. Where is the place value of 1000? Unit 10, 100, 1000. This is 2. Next last part is 1166. Question is 60. 60, 60 means this is the tens number. It means where is the place value of tens? Unit 10, this is the 10. 60 have a 2 number, 2 where numbers concept have a tens, uh, uh, tens concept. So, we write the 60, it means <coughs> 6 and 60. Now, question number 4. Question number 4, write the value of red digit in words. In, the, uh, in, the, in this book, the <coughs> we, write the, we write the value of the red digit in words, but we have a no marker of red. So, <coughs> red, uh, circle the red numbers. Question number 4, R write the value of red digit in words. A part is 2000 970 B part is 8361 <coughs> C part is 5495 <coughs> D part is 1832. Now write the write the value of red digit in words. Uh, where is the place value of 2? Just uh, same as it is we write the uh, unit 10, 100 and 1000. This is very easy way. Unit 10, 100 and 1000. Where is the place value? 1000. It means this is 2000. Now, same as write as the unit 10, 100, 1000. <coughs> where is the place value of uh, uh, red? Well, where is the red value of place? This is the place on 100. It means 3. 100. Now, next number is 5 and 9. 9, where is the place value? Unit 10, 100, 1000. 9 place on 10, it means this is 10 means 90. Now, where is the place value? Unit 10, 100, 1000. 8 place on 100, 8 is the red and 8 place on 100, it means this is 800. The part E to H, question number 3, E to H is your homework. <coughs> If you write the uh, uh, up, uh, if you write the value uh, if you write the unit ten hundred thousand uh, on the value uh, upper the value so this is very easy for you okay, which is the place value uh, uh, three the thousand two thousand three hundred nine tens uh, nine tens mean ninety eight hundred.
okay now next the concept is the using an abacus this is very easy concept using an abacus page number 8 page number 8 using an abacus complete the number sentence for each abacus write the number show question number 1 a part these numbers uh, these abacus have a four lines 1 2 3 and 4 it's mean this is unit 10 100 and 1000 first part is two rings in 1000 in 100 six rings in tens Five rings in unit eight rings. So two ring two rings in thousand one and two. It's mean two thousand. How many rings in hundred? One, two, three, four, five, six, six hundred. How many rings in tens? Ten. One, two, three, four, five. Five tens. Five tens means fifty. And how many rings in unit? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So unit means single. Unit means single. It means this is eight. Then answer is. Two thousand six hundred and fifty-eight. Two thousand six hundred and fifty-eight. Just write the first digit of that number. <coughs> Same like as B part. B part is. These abacus have four lines. It's mean unit ten, hundred, and thousand. How many rings in thousand? One, two, and three. It's mean how many rings in hundred? One, two, three, four, five, six. Seven, and this uh, uh, line have no rings. It means this is zero, and this is nine in unit nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. <clears throat> One, two, three, three thousand. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, seven hundred. No rings in tens. It means this is zero. And one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. It means this is nine. Three thousand seven hundred and nine. Three thousand seven hundred. Tens is zero, so this is zero and nine. Which line have uh, empty? Which line uh, is empty? It means this is the zero place value. Now page number nine. <coughs> page number nine is also very easy. Page number eight. Question number one. C two. F part is your homework. Now page number nine. Page number nine. Write the number show on each abacus. In previous question, 
<coughs> uh, you have to uh, some missing number uh, uh, to, you have just write the missing number now in this question it is very easy question number two <coughs> write the numbers shown on each abacus <clears throat> a part is this is also the concept of thousand because this have a two four lines unit ten hundred thousand in this question uh, uh, some rings uh, in this uh, some rings uh, in put in the abacus one two three one two three one two four one Two, <clears throat> three, four, five, six, seven, eight, one, two, and three. It's mean thousand unit ten hundred. Sorry, uh, one, two, three, three thousand. One, two, three, four, four hundred. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 80 1 2 3 83 3483 question number 2 b2 f part is your homework now question number 3 draw the correct number of beads on each abacus to match the number in uh, previous question question number 1 and 2 uh, you have just write the number from a uh, uh, look at the abacus now <coughs> uh, this abacus are empty you have just write the uh, you have uh, uh, some numbers and just draw the beads question number three first part is 1426 just write the just read the unit 10 hundred and thousand 1426 which is the first number one it's mean one beads four it's mean four beads one two three four how uh, two it's mean two beads six it's mean six beads so <clears throat> just in this question you have some numbers just uh, draw the beads on the empty abacus question number three c b to f part is your homework 